Hey Capricorn, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support and I hope all is well with everyone. Today we are going to find out what are your important general love messages. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not apply to each and every one of you. Alright Cap, let's get your reading started. Spirits and Angels, please show me. Important love messages for Capricorn today. show me more okay cap please bear in mind that roles can be reversed in this reading could either be you or your person you are thinking about or dealing with um, what I'm seeing here with the four of pentacles and with the nine of pentacles in reverse as well as the ace of swords in reverse somebody is not saying that they need you, okay? Or it could go vice versa. Now, Pentacles in Reverse can be a bit of a codependency energy that I'm getting here. Um, Nine of Swords in Reverse coming out of a stressful situation, trying not to think. And with the King of Swords here in Reverse, all the Swords here are in Reverse. However, because the Four of Pentacles is right in the middle here, and we've got Two of Cups in Reverse as well, I feel like somebody is just holding still is still holding on to this connection but not actually saying it because swords indicates communi uh, communication when it's all in reverse it indicates somebody is not communicating it okay and i feel or not showing it so nine of pentacles in reverse again it could indicate codependency somebody feels that they need you but they're not saying that to you okay or it could be you feeling this way and Two of Cups in Reverse also indicates a separation. So I feel like ever since the separation, somebody could be harboring these thoughts and feelings because we have Cups here in regards to how they actually, again, need you. <laughs> a bit of a codependency. Maybe the, the neediness could be in a form of uh, money or emotional, okay? In whatever way shape or form actually so we've got the sun here this indicates a leo energy nine of cups is in reverse i feel like again i don't know why it's like somebody deep down is dissatisfied but they're showing to the world with the sun here that i'm okay i'm doing fine i'm happy i'm happy um, liberating myself from this person from this connection but deep down there's still a lot of uh, discontentment or dissatisfaction or unhappiness okay Six, six of Swords in Reverse, this may indicate somebody feeling stuck. They, yeah, definitely not moving on yet, but justice to me, somehow to me, it looks like a poker face. Somebody's trying to look like unfazed with no emotions whatsoever, as if, you know, a bit of a righteous, self-righteous energy that I'm getting here could be your person feeling this way, or again, roles can be switched. We've got the Eight of Pentacles in Reverse, and we've got the Two of Swords here. Yep, this may indicate no communication right now between the two of you or that could be an indecisiveness going on. Someone could be feeling split into two, needing to make a decision. If it's not that, two of swords could just indicate a block communication. Either they could, your person could have blocked you or you could have blocked them. Uh, if not, it just could mean no communication right now. I feel like also with the two swords and justice here, yeah, there is a very self-righteous energy that I feel that this person may be feeling like, 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 I don't want to hear, I don't, I, I don't want to hear, I don't want to see. I don't care. All I know is I'm right. That's what I'm getting here, okay? However, there's this energy also that says, you know, I know I need this person in some way, shape, or form. I haven't let go of this person yet. I still haven't moved on yet, but I'm not going to show it. I'm not going to say it either, okay? Eight of Pentacles is in reverse. I feel like this may be an indication of somebody stop again. Um, I feel focusing on this connection or trying to show as if they're not focusing on this connection. Somehow I feel it's just a front, all right, with the justice, with the sun. Someone, I don't know who, could be you or your person, may appear looking so happy. Yep, I'm doing the right thing and whatnot. But deep down, look at the Eight of Swords here. Deep down, they still think a lot about you, still feeling really stuck still can't move on okay but let's see a little bit more wow 
My hands are actually very slippery because they are dry. <laughs> I just moved to this villa. Oh, I'm not sure if I already mentioned if this table looks different. It's because I've moved to a different villa and I ran out of moisturizer. I threw out throughout the the other one because I didn't want to bring it with me it's too heavy so but anyway let's get back to your reading six of cups here for me this indicates somebody missing somebody again there's a there are a lot of thinking missing reminiscing um, a sense of nostalgia and also this may indicate somebody returning okay uh, Capricorn this could also indicate with the Sun here someone could be feeling hey I'm seeing things very clearly finally I know that I need this person and I think I should return but I'm actually I, I don't know what I should do okay should I move forward should I take actions or shouldn't I okay and with the seven of ones here in reverse this may indicate somebody letting go also or appearing like they don't want to fight for this connection but truly they want to okay truly the six of cups you know the love is still there for sure but I do sense somebody hardening up okay uh, it could be you, it could be your person. And Nine of Pentacles is in reverse. This is your energy, Capricorn, um, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. But Nine of Pentacles in reverse, I feel like in, the, in this case, I feel like it could be you guys, okay, uh, Cap, that maybe you have stopped focusing on this connection, no longer working towards it, okay? Try not to do anything about it as well. Perhaps it could also indicate having, with the Eight of Swords here, having still, you know, memories in regards to what had happened. Could be trauma as well. But of course, Six of Cups, this may indicate somebody returning or wanting to return. Yep, and to heal this connection with the Ten of Swords here in reverse. The Lovers in reverse and the Queen of Wands for some of you, if you are involved, if you're involved in a third party situation, I feel that the third party is not there anymore somebody may have made a decision or is thinking about ma making the decision to drop the third party because the queen of wands can be a third party the other woman or the other man with her being in reverse doesn't matter he or she is not gender specific i feel like she is no longer in the picture or will no no longer be in the picture however <coughs> capricorn if this is you or it could be your person okay um i do sense somehow queen of wands in reverse can also a little mm, can be a little bit like the king of wands not exactly but i feel like hmm, somebody may have cheated may have lied okay not all of you because ten of swords could indicate betrayal and sometimes the lovers could also indicate an affair so could be an apology six of cups here and uh, apology coming in for you guys or you could go vice versa and eight of swords here definitely i feel like somebody could be feeling guilt carrying a lot of guilt and thinking maybe they should return or they should apologize all right capricorn this is your reading hope you resonated if you did please hit like share and subscribe i'm gonna leave you with a playlist on the screen right now this is the playlist from my second vlog channel if you're interested check it out and also i'm open for personal reading uh, if you guys would like to book me, my information is in the description box box below. And Cap, um, I post your videos almost every single day. If you like to be notified every time when I post your videos, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. All right, take care, Cap. Take care. Bye. <laughs>